Hello, this is that big bird. And look what we got here. In the last episode, I said that I would get sugarcane, and I did. Not only did I get this sugarcane, I also got extra. That's crazy. That's, uh, that's, I know it's crazy. You know, things have been pretty good here. I got a, um, whatever these guys are called. Wandering trader stuck up here. He's invisible right now, obviously. Pff, why would he be visible? That would be embarrassing. That would be embarrassing. Now that I have all of the paper, I can finally craft myself some rockets, which I already did because, you know, gangster of life. Am I right, guys? I just want you to see this thing is insane. Look at all those monsters. That like that's a lot. It's like at least eight monsters. You know what I'm saying? We need to go look for a village, cause I need villagers just so that I can get like basic good gear. I'm a little bit worried. It's gonna be very difficult to find a village. You know, I, I really don't like birds. I literally, I don't even know how people can even like think about birds. This is a lot of jungle. This is worrying. <laughs> I love fast food. Oh, my elytra is about to break. No, you know what? I'm going to land. Oh my golly. I don't even know where my house is now. I'm going on a trip through the jungle. It's so fun. I might get a fungal virus. It's a little kitty cat. How about that? I probably shouldn't just murder animals. That was that was mean of me. I'm sorry. Uh, it's fine. I'll just I'll just reincarnate him into another cat. Do you want to be re? Do you, do you want to help me reincarnate a cat? Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, my elytra is basically dead. That's good to know. I'm gonna just you know just do a little bit of um research online and just find you know don't even worry about it. I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a sleepy time before my travels, okay? That did not restore it much at all. That's nice. Here we are. I literally never would have found this. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna take our time, our freaking time. I probably should have just brought some more stuff with me. That would have been smart. I need to go pick up some ores oh look at look at all my friends we're gonna go get myself some ores and then we're gonna move them into the sky it's gonna make so much sense it's gonna make literally so much sense you're gonna be like oh dang that's a lot of sense hello water what are you doing <laughs> That's crazy, man. What? That's crazy. Alrighty, let's uh, go. So, is there somebody? Oh, there's two people already in there. You guys just stay in there. Now, I just need to make a way for them to get out of there. Wow, this is a big village. It's a shame you're all coming with me. <laughs> <laughs> so basically we're gonna put the villagers in separate boats and then we're gonna bring them into the sky and then we'll just move them from there it's simple as that oops that's your house <laughs> i couldn't tell this is the most inefficient place to put a house guys we'll simply have that right there no <laughs> come back to me you know what is actually easier that requires me to not use this at all is these guys want to sleep. We need to come into your some beds. I'm sorry for your beds. They're mine now. There we go. There we go. Go into the boat. Thank you. Alrighty. I'm going to be placing these blocks for a long time. <laughs> So this is the extent of it. It's not terribly long. So I am just going to lure them with beds over and over again, essentially. Oh, where's your friend? I swear, if he fell down, what happened to him? Did you kill your friend? Good job, buddy. You're so smart. I didn't even want that other villager that fell. Why would I even want him if he fell down? Oh, look at that. Actually, what well, wasn't too bad. Who's ready for a road trip? And then we come over here. 
and we place them down. And then they follow like the good servants that they are. Oh, idiots. I don't even know how you did that. Don't fall off. That's not smart. Look at that beautiful monstrosity. We're gonna crash! That actually did damage. You could you literally could have just killed me right now. And we have arrived. Are you guys are you guys warm in your in your wilderness explorer blouse? I'm gonna call this the villager hole. In this villager hole, we're gonna have just some you know some breeding going on. It's gonna be a fun time. They're gonna really enjoy it this way. You wanna go in there. There we go, guys. Good job. Who wants a job? Uh, infinity, that's not bad. So we're just gonna trade with you, son. Okay, you need to get mending. Cool, okay. So now we have a mending villager. He's not, not super cheap, but that's right. I'll give you some alone time, guys, okay? Yes! We already got a little baby boy. Oh, he's a little jungle boy as well. Let's just go get myself some building blocks, I guess. I'm just gonna make a shabby little shack for these guys to stay in. Ultra simple in design. I feel like every time I make one of these, I get a little bit better at it. Oh, uh, don't you love this terrifying building? Perfect. So, this is where they'll, they will all be. They're just living in the darkness of, I don't, even, I don't even know if you could describe it as darkness. You know what? I think I'm gonna call it for this episode. If you guys have enjoyed it and can't wait to see these guys, you know, form an even bigger family in the next episode, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. I love you all so much. Peace out.